Now we have a look at how Nike, the world's most valuable sports brand, will begin reopening its doors all across the country this week. Nike President Heidi O'Neill, good enough to join us from her home to tell us about the apps, the new tech, and their playbook for helping shoppers feel safe. Good morning, Heidi. Good to have you with us. Hope all is going well there on the West Coast. I know you're very excited about the Nike stores all across the country reopening. You all were one of the first to close your doors. What was the decision in reopening and how are you going to keep your employees and, cu and customers safe, Heidi? Uh, good morning, Robin. So nice to be here with you. Yes, we were one of the first retailers to close our stores to protect public health, and we're going to great lengths to uh, make sure we keep everyone safe as we start to open our stores in a rolling manner around the world. You know, that means first and foremost following our government and health guidelines. And we're also uh, providing some great new services that make shopping easier and safer in a world of social distancing. You know, we have 100% of our stores open in both South Korea and China. So that's given us a great model uh, to know how to build a playbook to open our stores uh, safely. We uh, have great cleaning procedures. We disinfect every day. We clean every two hours and more in other surfaces. All of our employees are provided with masks and, uh, and we have great social distancing signage in our stores. And, and you know, we've been able to keep our employees and all of our shoppers safe in the doors that we've started to open around the world. So how, what tech are you using? What th this contactless app or something that's going on here that's gonna help with social distancing. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Sure, yeah, Robin, I know you know about us for our innovation in, in basketball, footwear and apparel, but we're also innovating in retail in a few ways, you know. Um, we're, we're providing some great services that uh, allow uh, contactless experiences at retail. So we've launched our self-checkout, where you can um, check out of the store with um, all of your Nike gear um, with completely in a contactless manner. And my favorite one is we call it click to try or click to uh, buy. And if you see one of our mannequins in one of the stores, you can just use our Nike app and scan a barcode and first of all, to give you all the information of the whole display, everything you're seeing on all of the mannequins, but then it'll allow you to buy it right there in your size, or it'll also allow you to have it sent straight to the fitting room. And from a digital perspective, oh, wow. shopping is important now, but um, we think working out is as important. We believe in making sport a daily habit. And even when we're stuck at home, uh, or maybe especially when we're stuck at home, we need to find some outlets to stay fit. So we've ramped up our services from our Nike Training Club and our Nike Running Club as well to make sure everyone has great experiences to work out home at home. And we're seeing a real I'm increases in workouts logged. I'm sure people really do appreciate that. One last question. The Last Dance. Okay, now Air Jordans were just as popular as Michael Jordan in The Last Dance. I know that you all put out a special, uh, during the premiere, you had some special Air Jordans that sold out just like that. Uh, there were a pair of Air Jordans that he wore that just went to auction for more than half a million dollars. What does the Air Jordan brand mean to, to Nike? It's incredible, isn't it? You know, I've had a couple of my Zoom calls over the last few weeks with Michael Jordan. And we've been talking about this incredible success and energy around the brand, the man, and basketball. And for us, it's just great to see while sport is paused, you know, around the world that we've got a place to connect with him in basketball. And, and you know, our, our sneakers app is, is our app where you can, you know, shop, explore, or score. Uh, some of our uh, our greatest Jordans, Converse and Nike as well. And we've never seen more engagement on the sneakers app um, than we're seeing right now. And, uh, and we've even launched this great new service uh, on the Nike app called Kick Check. So well, what we've seen happen is as everyone's watching The Last Dance, we can't be together to watch it, but everyone wants to know what sneakers you're wearing. So you can um, take a photo of your shoe and 
and share your kicks uh, with millions around the world. And we're seeing tens of thousands of our, our people on the sneakers app um, checking with each other the sneakers they're wearing uh, every day since the last dance began. Yeah. yeah. Show those kicks. That's right. Well, yeah. Heidi, yeah. thank you very, very much. And I know that you're concerned and want to make sure that your employees as well as the customers are safe going forward and doing all that you can to do that. Appreciate it very much. You take care. Be we'll sure check in with you down the line. Robin, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.